Aloha. Today I'm here to unbox Good Bean Box. I didn't want to brush my hair today, so I'm staying behind the camera. But again, I got another awesome Good Bean Box this month, so I wanted to come out and tell you all about it. First up is the So Organics Insect Repellent. It's full size, retail value is $20, and take a look at these ingredients. Delicious. Um, this is one of the reasons I love Good Bean Box and I keep subscribing is they send items that are not just beauty or skincare. Next up is the Me Too We Rafiki bracelet. This is the third month in a row that I've gotten one of these bracelets. Again, another fun non beauty, non skincare item. It's also doing some great work. Retail value is $10. So already we're over the cost of the box here at $30. Next up is this really fun, interesting product it's called the Moon Dani Natural Breath Mist. I drink a lot of coffee, and when I say a lot of coffee, I mean a lot of coffee. So getting some natural breath mist is great for me because I try not to chew gum because I have TMJ. So hallelujah for breath mints, and I'm sure the rest of the world thanks Good Bean Box for sending me breath mist. All right, next up is this resurfacing enzyme mask from Bonnie made in Chicago it's got willow bark pomegranate oil and beetroot in it it's kind of fun here's what take a look at what it looks like I've already used it and loved it all right my least favorite item in the box is this otocyte hand and heel therapy it's got a really strong smell of spearmint plus it's in this weird bottle like really hard to get out of here. I generally love o the Otisite line. I just am not in love with this product because of the spearmint smell. But no love loss. It wasn't a huge sample. All right, last product is this Juice Organics, not to be confused with Juice Beauty, um, shampoo and conditioner. And as you can see, I've got four large samples here, perfect for travel if you already have a shampoo you like. Um, the one thing that I noticed, and I've been doing a lot of research about shampoos lately that I was really excited about is the first couple of ingredients are aloe, white grape juice, and apple juice. And then you see some of the other things that make it like a shampoo. But um, in a lot of the shampoos that you see, the first couple of ingredients are those things that make it foam or um, some other inorganic kind of synthetic ingredients. And right off the bat, this one's got some great stuff, so I can't wait to try it. Anyway, that was my box this month. Thanks for watching.